Uh, so our first crazy Karens get into a very heated confrontation at the store, and that's when things got ugly really quick. Exactly why Let's I stay at home took everything and me not punch this lady. The old me would have dragged her ass. Okay, I'm don't sorry. play with me. I don't play about my kids. I will split your mother wig, all right? You were in a school. No, zone. I ain't on a clock. I will split your mother wig and get get on your mother. I don't I'm even tired know of your mother. Trying to play me like I ain't. That one ghetto bitch, you... I'll give you mother. Ghetto. Good, I'm reporting you, you to the cops. I already called them and I thought a complaint with Marcy about Will them. you please leave? I'm leaving. We are asking you to leave nicely. Will you please leave? I tried to apologize if you felt threatened. Will you, you can, this is, the, the game has been over for 15 minutes. No, please sir, it leave. Hasn't. It just hasn't. It's been over and for 15 minutes. And I asked you. I asked you. Will you please leave? I asked you and I was apologizing if you felt threatened by me. I asked you, you not to please swear. I wanted on, you. I wanted on your video. Thank you. Please and leave. And I asked you not to swear You're in front of the kids. Thank you. I didn't swear one time. Okay. And I thought I that don't. you did and I felt that you did. As well, I didn't. I asked you not to do that. Will you please leave? I am leaving. I called the police. Will you please leave? Stop here. Really? You're on camera. This is going on Facebook. That's so scary. Thank That's you. So fucking scary. All right. So in our next clip, these police officers thought this woman had a body in the back of her car, and you will not believe what happens next. Let's check it out. All right. So in our next clip, this crazy Karen goes toe to toe with these employees at Starbucks. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. Let's check it out. Getting ready to attack at Starbucks. Alright, so in our next clip, this police officer was having a tough first day on the job and things did not go the way she expected it to. Let's check it out. I wish you would have hit my car. <laughs> I want to know what the emergency is. Yeah? I want names and badge numbers. Why are you blocking off a whole road? There's a pregnant woman. What's your name and badge number? What's yours? So this is legal to block a whole road? For what? So what? what is this? Yeah, then move. Then move. Get off the road. You have no right to block a whole Tyrants, out of here! Bunch of clowns in costumes, motherfuckers! 
This woman has an epic meltdown after her dog got chased by another dog that wasn't on a leash. So let's check out the full clip. You guys make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on the situation right here. Let's check it out. Oh my god. Walk away, bitch. Oh. Uh, so these next group of women get into a very heated confrontation with this crazy Karen over a parking spot so let's check out the full video you guys make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here you are now watching endless uploads and your pregnant girlfriend like whatever i don't care you guys came into bath and body works and seen me first bitch you walked in after us you walked in after us you walked in after us i watched you walk in i watched you walk in Get in. What you gonna do? You, you need, need to, to leave. You, you need, need to leave. To leave. Okay, yeah, well, you scared? scared? I ain't scared of Pussy shit. Ass bitch. Fuck whore. you. Out. What you gonna do? Leave. Whose baby is it? Kevin's or Will's? Fuck you. Who leave. Is it? Will's leave. Or Kevin's? Leave. Whose baby is it? It's Kevin's, ma'am. Oh, it's Kevin's baby. You hear Kevin? You need to leave. Yeah, you need to leave. Yeah, I'll just take you back to court. I'll just take you back to court because we have the no contact order. We'll take you back to court. I don't we can go to court anyways when he takes his baby from you. He won't. He can't. He, he can't. Just leave. Like, he can't. You're blocking you. other people too. Just give him the contract. Just as much rights as you. So can you leave? Can you leave? You understand there's a no contact order. I don't give a shit. The bitches in Brad Creek, this is where the fuck I work at. This is where the fuck I work at. So I don't give a fuck. This is where the fuck I work at. The bitches in Brad Creek. This is why y'all are both Jeez, unfit parents. The fuck home. I don't need to stay home. You then? need to leave. What you gonna do then? You need to leave. What you gonna do? So our next thing, Karen has an epic meltdown after she got kicked off with this roller coaster, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments. Have you ever seen some crazy stuff happen at an amusement park? <laughs> It is good to know. We won't be coming up here anymore. We're crazy, but she saw us in Bath and Body. Oh, I deserve wow. to die. Wow, deserve to die. She threatened to stab you. She threatened to stab me, and I deserve to die. She's saying you need to. Do you deserve to fight? Pregnant, by the way. So our next crazy Karen gets a taste of her own medicine while in Mexico. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. This is the mass Karen Slayer in Endless Up. Iba caminando en la Condesa, en la Ciudad de México. 
Le reclamé a esta gringa que porque traía sus perros sueltos y se molestó. Ben, you have to put the leash on, eh? And if you're in Mexico, if you're in Mexico, so this next guy goes toe to toe with this crazy Karen all because he felt like he was speeding so let's check out the full clip you guys make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here going over for uh, 15 miles an hour okay sir i can tell that you record for my safety okay you sir go right ahead and okay all you want all right because i really don't care okay turn around at your face a little bit there you go now what are you gonna do with it put on youtube no. uh, instagram you know i just i'm just i don't understand the problem i wasn't speeding sir you weren't no what if i detain you here and we got a ticket written for you how are you gonna detain me uh easy how i can reach in there and grab your ass and bring you out of this car all right bro i'm leaving leave me alone bro Uh, so this next actor has an epic meltdown all because his crew kept messing up. Let's jump right into it. So what the f keep going? I am acting here and this head wanders onto my set. I can't even get a line out until Dopey the starts whispering in your ear and you're not even watching anymore. Dennis, Dennis. So don't f Dennis me. I am doing my job here. I am a pro. This is the most unprofessional set I have ever been on. This is horse shit. I've got these zombies over here that I have to look at. I have a bunch of staring at me and this baby. This is garbage. Damn, he mad, huh? Blow me. So this next woman confronts this handyman for harassing her. So let's check out the full video. And I'm going to definitely need you guys to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. And look, if you enjoy watching these type of videos, you already know. Hit that bell for notifications. Mass Karen Slayer and endless uploads. We got you. Let's check it out. Right now, the fact that I'm still, the fact that I got a little weird with you yeah. is because I just, I'm a guy, whatever the fuck. Don't hold that against me right now. All right. I just want a little don't, space. No, I don't up. care what the fuck you want. I just honestly. I don't. I do not care about you honestly wanting a little space right now. All right. Because you know the, the reason I say that right now. Yeah. Is I could leave right now. You'd have no water. Okay. Your carpets aren't clean. Okay. Your fucking blinds aren't up. Yeah. And nothing's taken care of. So if you ignore me right now, even if you look at your phone once, I'm leaving. Okay? Don't look at your fucking phone once. Pay attention to me. I got your carpet, your blinds, and your fucking water on the line. Mm -hmm. How are you going to treat me right now? I just said... How, how about... Uh, so this next video was crazy as hell, guys. So I'm going to definitely need you guys to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this one so this guy right here is a bar owner in south africa and this guy calls out and confronts him when he finds out that he doesn't allow black people inside the bar unless they have a white person with them yeah you heard that crazy shit, guys but anyways like i said let us know in the comments what you think this is endless uploads let's jump right into it it's not a calm situation it's maybe calm for you because you don't give a because you think you have the right to tell whoever you want to come in, but you don't. Did I, it's a, you said on the phone, I, I have the right to tell whoever to I let in. I, no, I you don't. Right, you don't have the right to discriminate in this country. It's a I crime. Right for reservation. If, for, uh, on the basis of race. Do you? Uh, Do you? Uh, yes or no? Do you? My brother, don't interrupt. This is what time. happened. Okay. This man right here, Fabiso, came in yesterday. Okay. Right. Moments after Jordan came in. Moments after. Okay. Your bouncer stopped him and said, why are you going in? Who are you going into? Okay. okay. He said, why are you asking me? He said, you can't come in here unaccompanied without a white person. He said, what? He said, you can't come in here without a white person. If you come in here, I know what you like. You steal, you guys cause trouble. You need to come in here with a white person. He asked him, who decides this? This is what the bosses have told me. Then Jordan, not knowing where Tabiso is, goes out and sees the bouncer re-explain this and says it to him again and says, it's not me who decides, it's the policy. Now, I'm sure if this had to fucking get out, there's a lot more people that have experienced this. This is firstly okay. a crime. I'm not done speaking. When I'm done, I'll give you an opportunity. 
It's supposed to be a crime in this country. Do you know where you exist? You exist in South Africa, where we have a deeply painful history of this shit. Secondly, this shit will fucking blow up. An institution like Hans, you're known. You're not a fucking somewhere in the middle of nowhere. You can't be fucking doing this shit. You will become like clicks overnight. You have protesters outside your fucking door. Do you think this is all right? Is this the practice of the business? Is this how you've decided and instructed your fucking bouncers to do? Speak. You clearly know about this. Well, listen. We've been trading for eight years. We've never had an incident ever before. And I can speak for our barman. And uh, we've got an eclectic. I mean, I can what are you saying? Incident. Address just the on. issue. Just hang on a second. Eclectic. What the fuck? A, we, we've got a. We've never had a, a, a race issue here before. Is that is that correct, Danny, or not? Okay. So what does that mean? So, uh, what the fuck does that mean? I'm building up to. He's what aware of it. He's aware of it. I've heard. So our next care neighbors get into a very heated confrontation, and that's when things got ugly. Really quick. Let's check it out. She gonna end up getting hit? What the hell is she doing? Karen. What is she doing? She running. She running. She running. She running. She was running. But she hit him. Dog is named. 